Flipped learning starts with one question. What is the best use of your face-to-face -face class time? You see, all of us as educators really have a certain amount of time to be face-to-face -face with our students. What is the best use of that time? I will argue that the best use of that time is not you standing in front of the classroom with, say, the chalkboard behind you lecturing. What could you do differently that would change everything? Well, the flipped classroom is one way to maximize the time that you have with your students when you are face-to-face -face with them. Making videos that the students can watch, or you could use somebody else's videos, but making those videos can actually free up class time to do that valuable, important thing. So I, I don't really know the answer for what's the best use of your face-to-face -face class time, but I'll bet you do. I'll bet it's not you standing in front of your students and lecturing at them for whatever period of time you have. So let's rethink the class time by flipping the instruction. In the morning, I'm going to be sharing with you about uh, flipped learning and just kind of get an overview of what it is and how it can work in uh, a college setting. And then in the afternoon, I plan to spend some time kind of with people who've already had some kind of gist of, they know a little bit about the flipped classroom, they've done a little practice to really kind of have more of a discussion session about how is this going to actually work, what are some sort of big Q's and A's, really much more of an interactive session in the afternoon that will cause us to really dig deeper into how flipped learning can transform um, university education. I'm looking forward to visiting UT Brownsville and sharing the transformative story of flipped learning.